is up, Machine Freaks. I hope you guys are feeling froggy, fresh, fresh to death. Super fly, all those amazing things. One of the dirt bags, gotta start this beast up. Turn it around, hook the trailer up, put the gator on the trailer. Let's do it. Or not. It's really strange, the Duramax has been, it has some sort of a parasitic withdrawal or whatever you want to call it. It loses voltage, it's got two nice batteries in it and sometimes it dies within like 24 hours and sometimes it just uh, works perfect. I will tell you that I'm glad I have this thing. I think I only need three things. That's uh, the gator, fuel, and these things for both uh, my co-pilot and I. They're earplugs. You wanna try to hear this thing without these things? No? You don't want to hear it? You want to just go right for the, yeah. the earplugs? It's pretty loud. I want to be able to hear when I'm 70. What? Yeah. <laughs> I'll take two. Thank you, sir. Oh, we made it up to the place. We got hay. We got the gator. We got our co-pilot slash victim, Jake oh, the Toilet yeah. Snake. The gator's going to blend right in with the hay. It's going to feel like it's back in this original environment. Right. The farm. It's going to get extra horsepower that way. It has the sexiest starter on the planet. Why do you say that? Because you're the starter. <laughs> okay. Here are the fuel injectors, fuel pump. Yesterday when uh, Jason and I uh, were trying to start this for the first time after we like did everything, the thing didn't want to start. And then we figured that out and then it didn't want to like run well. So then we figured that out. So we got down to like the last 30 minutes where he could actually ride it and we, he didn't make it. So Jason, I'm sorry, but I guess Jake the Toilet Snake oh. is our first victim. <laughs> Instead of you. This could be a good thing for you. Don't tell him that though. All right, start her up. For some reason, it's not working right now. We gotta be careful though, because I don't want this blowing up. Like, I should have put a cover on it.
I bet you we still got two thirds more. I have to, I basically have to drive like that. Cause like, if I just get on it, I feel like I'm gonna blow that transmission up. Why? Cause that thing's built for a nine horsepower engine. This is a 100 horsepower engine. 100. 10, 11 times. <laughs> scary i got right there i started slowing down about 20 feet after you yeah. and it just wasn't slowing down <laughs> i'm like i'm getting ready to jump out <laughs> no. i'm like if that cable's down there i am jumping off i think i'm doing something that i'm going to regret i'm letting jake the toilet take this guy has blown up and beat up a lot of things and i'm letting him play with the gator so hopefully he doesn't blow this thing up well, Jake's turned around. I want to tell you guys, I do plan on giving away the Gator. I'm not sure how I'm going to do it just yet, but uh, I, I do want to give this thing away. We're going to definitely fix it up better, paint it up better, put a wench on it, a light bar, definitely deck the thing out, and we're, we're going to give it away to one of you guys. So just stay tuned on the 3D Machines production schedule. Maybe you can win it. Uh, here, I want to try this turn out. Got a little muddy. Yeah. Definitely need some mud flaps on that thing. It's got a lot of torque. A lot of torque. Ah, two wheel in it. Definitely one crazy machine. Like right now, the the four wheel, the true four wheel, that little button right there. That's what that button does when you engage that. It uh, it does true posi. Really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But right now it's seized up, so like we don't have that. But this thing has enough power to spin two wheels. Like, that's pretty impressive. This thing couldn't even get out of its own way when we first got this thing. Like, it couldn't even get up any of these hills. And now it's, like, screaming up them. You're, like, into the throttle, off the throttle, into the throttle, off the throttle, into the throttle. You're not even, like, gone to the throttle. You're just like... Yeah. <laughs> I'm like how my grandmother drives. Yeah. That's how she drives her car. Uh, should we try Hang on Hill or something? I don't care. Do you think it'll make Hang on Hill? I don't think it's going to have no problem with traction. <laughs> it's got four wheels. What's wrong with your seat, buddy? It's a little it, muddy. It's, it's clean. That's good. This has got to be one of the best Tuesdays of my life.
Bye. <laughs>test the prototype and it's a successful first ride never yeah never i'm gonna call jason real quick go home hey how you doing you blew it up i blew it up did you blow it up what do you think do you think i blew it up i think you blew it up the engine or the transmission the transmission dude this thing is the scariest most fun thing i've ever ridden in my life and she didn't even let us down uh... She didn't want. She didn't even let us down. Oh, it still works, huh? Still works perfect. That's awesome. It's amazing, dude. It climbed the, the biggest hills we got. I put it up on three wheels. We bottomed her out, but got it out, and then uh, hit the hill again and made it up. Jake the toilet snake drove it, drove it and uh, he didn't even blow it up. So this thing is quite sophisticated. I'll tell you what, it goes fast, so we gotta get it to stop fast. We need better brakes in this thing. We can put... Uh, nice brakes. Hydraulic brakes on it, yeah, cables. Absolutely, absolutely. <laughs> Dalton thought he had it in forward to give that hill another try, Jason. Yeah. And he actually still had it in reverse and he pinned it in reverse and <laughs> started flying down the hill backwards. <laughs> <laughs>